Hey everyone, Austin back with another rowing video. Now one of my big goals is to inform you on all the information that you need about the variety of different rowing machines that are out there because a rowing machine is a big investment, but rowing is a very rewarding exercise but when it comes to choosing a machine, it's important that you know what machine you're getting and what's gonna work best for you. And part of choosing the right rowing machine for you is understanding what you wanna get out of your rowing experience. And right now I'm sitting on the Ergata rower, which I've covered in my initial first impressions video, as well as the Ergata versus Hydro comparison video. But the reason why I'm sitting on the Ergata today is to discuss a feature that is very unique to Ergata and really fills a specific niche that I think a lot of people are looking for when it comes to a rowing machine. And that niche is satisfying your competitive nature within. Now right now there are a few different ways in the rowing space to be competitive. You could check out the Concept2 logbooks and see where you stack up compared to all the other Concept2 users. Hydro has the interactive leaderboards that are displayed during each of the workouts. And both can be great ways to be competitive in your rowing experience. But Ergata offers something pretty freaking unique through their race workouts, where you're not just comparing yourself to the performance of others, but actually visually, interactively racing against others in specific rowing races. And in these race workouts, you literally line up with other users who have also done the same race workout and race them down the race course. In these race workouts, you can race up to eight other individuals, and those individuals can be automatically selected based off of your own performance level and who it thinks you'll be competitive with, or you can do what I personally like to do, which is manually select the individuals that you want to race against. And if you don't want to race against anyone else, you can race against yourself if you've done that race multiple times. And what's cool is when you're doing the rowing race, it feels like it's happening live, like everyone is rowing together, even though it's just using the data based off of the previous rows from the other users. And being able to see those individuals race against you gives you that little extra push that you need to really pour your heart out into the workout. One of the cooler features about these race workouts is that they're not just strict distances. Sure, they have things like the 2K, the 5K, the 10K, which are just straight through efforts, you know, same style of race, but just go for the distance. But they also have a huge variety of interval style training. For instance, a 2200 meter row that's broken up into 400, 500, 600, 700 meters with small rest breaks in between. You can see exactly where you stack up against the other users within the race as you work through those different intervals. And there is seriously a massive amount of race workouts to choose from, and you can filter them based off of duration or distance, so that way you can find exactly the kind of race that you wanna race. So who's down for the half marathon row? Or maybe the 150 meter sprint? The race workouts on Ergata seriously are an awesome way to fill that competitive desire to really push yourself and see where you stack up against others in a very dynamic and interactive way. Because sometimes you just want to hop on, row really hard, and just see where you stack up. So far in my experience, this style of competitive racing is unique to the Ergata platform and is something you should seriously consider if it's been kind of weighing on your pros and cons, your choice of rowers. With an ever-growing collection of workouts and a new race of the week every week as well, it's a good way to keep yourself coming back and seeing where you stack up each and every week. So the race workouts on Argata are pretty cool, and you should know that. And so that's pretty much it for this video. I just wanted to share what that racing experience is really like and give you some more information on that so that way you have more info in your buying power, in your rower choice selection. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Do you own the Ergata or are you thinking about it? Are you thinking about that and another rower? What's, what's on your mind? Share all of that down below if you'd like to. And be sure to subscribe to the channel if you're interested in more fitness and rowing content from me. And I will see you guys in the next video.